Dashcam owners in Indonesia for September 2024. Join me as we check out what do people do on the roads of Indonesia. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Stay with me while we check out some of the craziness that takes place on Indonesia's roads. It's just a few days ago on September 9th. Whoa! Ooh! That tire went kaboom! But littering, guys, don't litter, please. Keep your country clean. We can all work as a team and one team, one dream. Ooh! Alhamdulillah, while I was in Indonesia, I didn't see like any accidents. People are pretty good. And some cities had like, you know, rubbish where people would throw, but others were clean. Uh oh. And traffic's pretty bad. Like, there's so many times like it was in a cab and they're like just so close to each other. And I thought cars are gonna hit, but subhanAllah, people are, people are pretty good. I think that's another reason that they're changing the capital with the amount of people that are there. I think he he cut the traffic in the motorcycle. Oh, that's Dutch. Oh, they're <laughs> running red lights. <laughs> that was actually another thing. I didn't see a lot of people like... Uh, going against traffic lights where I was like in you know in Jakarta oh people were pretty good they would stop so I think government uh, vehicles those uh, tinted black usually or diplomats let me go go government workers like high government workers, like uh, lawmakers and whatnot. And they even have their own like lights, like blue lights. I miss Indonesia, man. I miss Indonesia. It was fun there, alhamdulillah. Okay, just cutting each other off but I don't blame them because they have to make a u-turn into another road since there's no proper signals right but inshallah hopefully you know in the new capital all if not most of these issues would be resolved because look they're trying to come from that side to go this way these guys are coming from the other side going that way and the roads are pretty dangerous for people who are motorcycle because they have no protection with cars at least you still can protect yourself but it's really dangerous for people on motorcycles and I found out <laughs> oh. Sort of, oh 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 that car is backing up he's gonna get it no 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 oh alhamdulillah they oh they did hit him oh wow It's 5.30 in the morning, the brothers playing Quran. Oh, 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 oh. Close. <laughs> Gotta keep your eyes on the road. Driving is dangerous, guys. Don't get distracted. Don't use your cell phones. Don't have, you know, distractions of too many friends in the car where they're getting you to get your eyes off the road. And sometimes even my wife, uh, you know, if she's on the phone, she's trying to show me something funny or tick on TikTok or Instagram. I'm like, hey, don't distract me. I got to keep an eye on the road because when we're driving, we have the life of everybody in the car in our hands. Since the car is basically like a weapon, if the driver doesn't pay attention and are distracted, they could kill everybody in the car. Alhamdulillah, it's not so bad. You know, we, we only saw, I think, one accident. Um, Oh, brake checking. 
Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Why, why? Uh, that road is empty. Why oh, you got a brake check? Just passing. Oh, they're both <laughs> brake checking each other, man. What's going on here? Oh, look at that tall building on the left. I miss Jakarta. Jakarta was fine. Warm. Oh, man. Lots of greenery, nice weather, good food. What's happening? Another thing is, I, although I don't have a, a dash cam myself, which I need to get, just a reminder for you guys too, if you can get a dash cam, because it always helps that the, the video never lies. Whereas um, if you get an accident, you don't have it. It's your word against the other person. I love those buildings, man. I love it. Vehicle ahead, motion detected. Ooh. Oh, they hit one another. Like vehicle ahead, motion detected. When cars are moving that slow, like. You shouldn't ever be getting in an accident, like, you know, I have respect, either let the person in front of you go or back off, you know what I mean, like, crazy. Sometimes you can't control it, like the cars are going fat. Mosul, he, he, he made it. Some of those guys are like, yeah, pretty, pretty crazy. I would get out of the way for them because when I was riding the motorcycle and uh, you'd be like in one lane and then they'd be like right behind you. So I'll move over. I'll let him go because I'm like, I don't want to create a traffic. And at the same time, I don't want them to go other ways, right, to, you know, uh, cut through traffic. So I just move around. I'm like, you guys go. I'm going to ride slow. Oh, he cut that motorcycle to go the other way. Ooh. Oh, brother Gojek, <laughs> Gojek, I remember the Gojek drivers, man, they're awesome. That was like one of the, oh, oh, they're going straight, it says do not enter. That was one of the things that I liked a lot in Indonesia was being able to use Gojek for a lot of stuff. Like, you know, I had my laundry that they came and picked it up took it to the laundry mat which was awesome so i didn't have to leave because i took like most of my clothes uh for them and they just came picked it up in a bag took it you know food medicine anything that you need any time of the day boom you order it from your app and there's outside your house apartment hotel whatever you need And another thing that I that I liked was the liveliness. You know, you wake up like four, five, four, five in the morning, and there are people out and about. You know, people like selling stuff, people just driving, people on the road, um, which was awesome. You know, here in Canada, like around six at night time, six p.m., everything closes, and you barely see people. Oof! Subhanallah, she survived. Not so bad. A little bit of crack, but that could have been worse. These roads are the ones that are scariest, where there's not a lot of... Ah! Did he hit them? I think he did. Oh my goodness. Careful, 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 careful. Don't hit nobody. Oh! That's what I was afraid of, because it was like... One of my few first, like, yeah, like I, I drove motorcycle here in Canada for like a few months, but I didn't have my full license. <laughs> and uh, when I went to Indonesia, I wanted to ride it. Ooh. But that's the thing that I was scared of was like, I didn't want to hit somebody's car. I didn't want to hit somebody on the road. Uh, but Alhamdulillah, it went pretty well beside uh, me crashing the, the bike and uh, getting a cut. 
again that was that was just um a new rider um uh, fault because when i try to take it out there was tile and the tires start slipping i didn't want to let go of the motorcycle Ooh. i didn't want to let go of the motorcycle so it doesn't hit other people instead i went with it and i crashed but alhamdulillah it's all a learning it's all an experience Ooh. He was going on the oncoming lane. Man. Oh, I hope they're, they're okay. Inshallah, they, they survive. That's another thing is cars, because it's usually like one lane, one lane, cars go into the, you know, oncoming lanes just to be traffic. And this brother was doing the same thing. And the bad thing is he hit a bus or a truck. I don't blame the car, it, it's not their fault, they, you know, they have hard time stopping because of their size. Oh, poor guy. I was on the ninth or something. Oh. Oh, look at that motorcycle. You can tell the impact, subhanAllah, it crunched it. Um, like I said, you know, most of the time people are pretty good, but there are some times that people are in a little rush. Uh, you know, you guys stay safe, uh, protect yourself, wear, make sure you wear your helmet, don't speed, don't cut uh, cars off, and, uh, you know, give yourself a little bit more space. I know sometimes we're all in a rush to kind of try to make it home faster, but at the end of the day, it's not worth it. It's, it's uh, best to be five minutes, ten minutes late and make it home alive than try to rush and, you know, get in a situation like that where you could be in, in hospital for months and that's if we're lucky and we survive those type of crashes so it's crazy guys uh, stay safe if you have other cool videos f uh, for me to check out please put in the comment section below as always if you can please smash that like button and also subscribe to the channel that'll mean a lot and help me inshallah to grow the channel and uh yeah guys take care of yourself and your family inshallah i'll see you guys in the next video take care and wassalam